Yo, welcome back to another banger video. So, in today's video, I will be doing my nails. As you can see, I'm fresh to start off, and I just recently took off my acrylics that I did. They were short acrylics, and today I will be trying to process and do some more acrylics. So, I got this thing of mist from when I do my nails because it's a whole mess, like on this table, y'all. My table is so dirty. From this nail. nothing to happen to my camera or nothing so i'm using my phone to record i mean like i have another phone so i'm good all right so yeah my area is a mess i'm gonna go ahead and put a towel on here so let me go grab a towel Please. This is Silver Sapplenova, head of stable international, a private security force. I, I scared scared her. Mayor Osborne. I said, wait, wait. She came and she got scared. Alright, I just scared somebody. They came into the house. I was like, well, well. Because it's like a, a part of a song. I scared them. <sighs> Alright, so. In this box is all my nail things. I just put them all in here. So first thing I'm gonna obviously use today is tips. I got some laying around for some reason. A whole bunch of tips laying around. I can put these to the side because I might have to use these tips. But this is just a couple of tips I have laying around. All right. So in this box, it's some things that I haven't opened and some things that I have opened. So, oh, something spilled. I smell it. So I got this glitter palette that I haven't used. And if y'all don't know, it's a glitter nail kit powder thing. I haven't used it. And I got another one, but this one. It's glitter. And these are glitters too. But these are not like the little glitter. These are like the huge glitters. I don't know if I'm going to do decorations today because I'm just a beginner in nail stuff. I mean, this is my first day. And I got these things I haven't opened. I got, like... Okay, so this is my little container to put it in and stuff. Dirty. Haven't cleaned it yet. This is the stuff to wash the stuff off and things. So, yeah, y'all, um... I'll be right back with y'all when I get everything set up. So, yeah. Alright, y'all, yeah, so. Okay. Cuticle remover. This is to trim the nail. Like, cut it to a size. I got some powder coloring. A cuticle pusher. This one is a, a big side. That's a thin side. I think this is Japanese, but I think this is a cuticle pusher, too. I got me the some um, acrylic powder brushes. Really pattern. The pattern is really pretty on these. Um, I got me a buffer. Uh, some liquid nail glue. Two at that. My scissors just dropped. A uh, whole bunch of nail tips. A whole bunch of nail tips. Some of them are even coming out. I got some of these. They went everywhere. Put these right here so they don't go over. I got this to wipe all the powder and stuff off after you file your nails. I got my little glass to put my this in. I got my acrylic powders. And I got my nail file, my glitter. And this right here is before you start, you put this around the cuticle area just to make sure it's good. So yeah, y'all. So first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start by applying this around my cuticle area 
to make sure you see, as you see I still have every type of thing on my nails so this will help my cuticles in case like if I put too much nail glue on my cuticles it will pull my cuticles up and you don't want it to be like that so let me do that and I'll be right back so I did them all see how shiny they are all right so I'm gonna apply my nail tips so first thing I'm gonna do is put all the tips on the right sizes and y'all that takes a long time for me to do so I'm gonna do the first part of it starting out right here and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put them on my nails so. Y'all, so I'm gonna only do one nail. Not, I'm only gonna do one set of hands for now just to make sure that they cute. Okay, so I don't want them to be this long, so I'm gonna kind of use my tip cutter and we're gonna cut. I just gonna cut a little bit down because I still got a file it and stuff. Filing kind of does kind of does thin it so. Alright, so now, just to make sure that the edges of them are good, we're going to file them down to, down to your designed it size. So, I'm glad that we're done with that nail group, that's all. Because they messed up my whole table, bro. And then, I don't know where it started smoking. I put some air freshener, like, because, like, it was really, like, it was hidden. And it stinks, so I spray some air freshener around, and then after I spray it, it got on the table. It started smoking, so I'm like, I'm gonna do this video, and I'm gonna end up having to put a um a cloth on it because that was my first thing that I was gonna do, but changed in minds. So yeah, y'all, I'll be right back when I file on my nails because these got some sharp edges. So yeah, I'll be right back when I get done filing these. I'm done filing them. So next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start applying my acrylic. So I got a uh, two acrylic pouch in the Anonymous. Pretty sure that's what it's called. As I said, I'm a beginner, so I don't know everything. So yeah, I'm gonna get everything prepared. I did all my nail tips, so at this moment I'm gonna move. Oh my freaking gosh. These nail tips are low key getting on my nerves because they're going every single way. I'm trying to move them so I have some space for the stuff that I'm doing now, but they're going everywhere. Alright, y'all. So I'll be back with y'all when I get it. While I was setting up, I remember I forgot to push my cuticles down. Okay, but I remember that I put the tips like this so I can screw them down now. So, yeah. I already forgot to do it.
Mr. Call. Are you still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but yeah, we should talk over dinner. Oh, this still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. Expectations. It's really hard to screw this one. This area is clean. I'm gonna start off and open the acrylic powder. I'm trying to make this video real short because um I mean like why well, because it's not really I mean I don't need to be spending no bro. I haven't I think it got nail glue on it, so <sighs> Y'all can't open this. And I'm done with the other one already. Well, that might be the one. I don't even know. So, we do you gotta push this up there. Alright, so, now. Okay. So, I got my powder open now. We're gonna get my little glass. And we're gonna pour some anonymous in it. Keep in mind, this anonymous is really strong, you guys. So make sure that you have like a face mask, or I mean, you don't have to wear a face mask, but just know, like this stuff is real strong, and then it wastes down. So super glad I got a table. I mean, a cloth, and this is a dirty cloth from the um, dishwasher, not the dishwasher, the laundry, dirty laundry, because I don't want to use no new cloth, and I just like doing this process and stuff. So I can put the nail glue up. Don't want to get that everywhere. It's closed anyways. All right. So for this, y'all see this? You don't want that on your brushes, okay? My sister was playing with my stuff and messed up my thing. Good thing I got four more here. But yeah, it might be workable. I mean, for my scissors, I could probably cut it or something. I mean, I learned you ain't supposed to cut this out. I mean, but at this process, I need need it to be cut. Yeah, and then on top of that, I saw a professional cutting her brush. And then she was a professional at the time. And I was recording everything she did because she said that it was okay if I did. It's, I did record everything that she was doing, so yeah, I went to go get my acrylics done, and I recorded everything she did, and after watching that video 10 times last night, I think I know what I'm doing. Alright, so, this right here, I use for the powder, I'm gonna cut it, well, I didn't have to cut it. You can just put these in water, and I think you'll do better. We're gonna use a new brush today. So y'all, they're really still, but what you gotta do, push them to the side. And now, they're a regular brush. All right. So what you gonna do? Well, what I do is on the side, I get a paper towel. So when you dip it in, make sure it's and I slowly drag it. Alright y'all, so this one right here is a clear one. Yes. And then you slowly wanna So the first bead is gonna be your cuticle bead. You wanna put it at the bottom where your cuticle is. That's the first cuticle. And I do this just to make sure that it's enough, um, what's the word? That it's enough, just enough amount for the first bead. So, yeah, you want to make sure you got that off at all times. Because you don't want that to stay on your brush because then it's going to mess the brush up in. It's gonna mess your brush up and it's gonna mess up your anonymous. 
that's in your glass. So yeah, you always want to make sure that you do that. And and on top of that, if this is a like it say clear, if it is a clear room, you want to make sure that it stays clear. And y'all, the top is supposed to be way bigger than any. And y'all, some people don't have that um thing that you put on your nails. So I'm not going to use mine today because some of y'all might not have those. So I don't want y'all to think that that goes in the process of this. But if you do, you guys, all you do is stick it on your nail and it helps you uh like keep the nail tip that size or make it longer or whatever you want to do i put a little bit too much powder so what i do is i go in with the uh, anonymer and i just go on top of it just to make sure that it's the right amount that i didn't pay way too much i mean it's okay to put too much well, not like that, okay, but it's kind of okay because all you have to do is go um, back around with the anonymer and then you can just file it, buff it, whatever. So it's not that bad, but y'all, yeah, that's the first one done. See, as y'all can see, the side right here is just a little bit off. So yeah, that's when you file it and stuff. So yeah, I'm going to do the rest of the nails and I'll be right back. I just got done doing a acrylic in. As you can see, the top of it is way bigger than the bottom. On the pinky, it kind of got overflowed because I got distracted. So, while I was watching my brother play Spider-Man, I was like, and I had moved. So, it messed up. So, we're going to file it. And you want a hard file for this. I used this side on the pointy side on my brushes to get, like, the uh, powder coloring on. Hey, it's me. And what I'm talking about powder coloring, these are powder colors. The color I'm going to be doing today is, is either this blue color or this purple color. This is the purple color, this is the blue color. In the, in the camera, it looks um, lighter. Well, my phone, it looks lighter because I'm recording on my phone because, as I said, I don't want no mess or nothing on my camera because my camera was way more than my phone was. So if this turns out good, then I will do the other side. I just don't want to do the other side because I have to do this side first. And then it's going to be hard to do this side because I'm this handed. So, yeah, come down below if y'all right handed too. I wish I had some uh some nail polish instead. But I don't so So yeah y'all. I guess I'll be back when I find this video because I as I said that I don't want this video to be long. So so right now I'm oh, opening my powder coloring, which this is really acrylic powder, but I wanted to use the clear one and then I'm going to use this one. I just like to do that better because it's easier to do than doing the regular way. What were they after? Just so, financial records. About Devil's Breath? I don't even know about that. Why do they want it? I don't even know what it is. Mr. Osborne's been pouring money into it for years, but he keeps the whole project a secret. I'm the only one who has any record of it. Not anymore. Right. Looks like they copied some records to a secure server. Payroll information. From a Dr. Isaac Delaney. Who is he? I, I honestly don't know. Yeah. So on this one, I'm going to do the first beat. And this is the color it is.
okay? Yeah, I think so. Good. Good. So after you done putting uh, one thing of beer, in, then you want to wipe it on a towel or a cloth. You don't want the cloth to be hard because that could mess up your brush. And I just messed it up somehow. Let me fix this, y'all. Alright. You okay? Yeah. Well, I didn't get much out of standing. So yeah, I'm gonna do the rest of the nails, y'all, and I'll be right back. Okay, y'all. So I'm done. As I said, I am a beginner. So I mean like I'm not that good, but all the instructions I said you guys were exactly right. I like this blue color. So yeah, y'all, that is the end of this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Hope you like these nails. Hope you like them so much. And yeah, that's the end of this video. As I was saying, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to press the notification because you're supposed to be tuned to every single video I do. And with that further ado.